If you have a Honda Ridge Line, I am going to show you how to take advantage of this unique pickup truck and do a mobile foot bath. Sounds crazy, isn't it? In Japan, foot bath is very common in many onsen towns using geothermal hot spring. It's very relaxing. I am trying to bring this to my truck. I believe Honda Ridge Line is the only pickup truck in this world can do this. As many of you have seen it before, this is the tailgate opening from the side. However, the most important feature is the in-bed trunk. The trunk is so big, you can hide yourself in there just in case of emergency. Don't forget, the truck comes with speakers in the bed. It's such a good idea to go with the foot bath when you are camping in the wild. It also comes with the built-in 400 watt power inverter. To make this project works, you need the Anova sous vide. Many of you would have this in your kitchen. It's a device for you to cook your food in low temperature with a plastic bag. If you don't know what it is, please Google it. For me, I stole it from my wife for this experiment. Don't tell her or I will get into trouble. Now, all you have to do is to attach this to the emergency floor jack using the releasable cable ties. That should be good enough. Next, we are using the garden hose to fill the trunk with water. It was unexpected to see leaking at the bottom. Honda actually designed for you to hold water and ice, but I guess they did not expect you to turn this into an aquarium. So, how do we fix it? It's very easy. We are using the plumber's putty. What's good about this stuff? It won't dry out and they are removable. Of course, it will create a very tight seal. That should do the work. Now, let's top it up again and see what happens. As expected, it fixed the problem and there is zero leak. Now, we need an adapter to convert 3 prong to 2 prong because the inverter does not have ground. I bought this adapter from Canadian Tire. Honestly, I doubt anyone in this world would buy this. I don't understand what is the use of this. This is 3 prong to 3 prong. <laughs> but for me, it is useful. All I need is to cut the ground using the hacksaw. You don't want to damage the extension cable, that's the idea. You may ask, is it dangerous without using ground? The answer is, maybe. Let's start the car and get 400 watt. If you don't, you are only able to get 150 watt. It will take a while to get the water temperature to the level you set on the ANOVA. You want at least 40 degrees Celsius or 140 Fahrenheit. Let's drive outside and do the test. It was snowing, that's perfect to get a food bath. All you need is a bottle of beer and relax for the rest of your day. It would be fantastic if I were at the campsite. Oh yes, don't forget to play your music using the embed audio system.
when it's time to go, just unplug it from the inverter receptacle. Next, of course, you want to drain all the water from the trunk. Honestly, besides foot bath, there are other use of this. If you are going for fishing, you can keep the fish alive by adding a pump. Or, if you run out of container and do some construction work, you can use this to mix cement or concrete. I hope this gives you some ideas, especially you are planning for some outdoor activities with this truck. But if you don't have this vehicle, there is another reason now for you to consider getting one. The most important part is, Honda did not let you know this is possible. Give this a thumbs up if you think it's a cool idea. If you love DIY and home improvement, remember to check out other videos on my channel. Please subscribe. Thanks for watching and see you next time.